This video demonstrates many of SecureCRT's time-saving copy and paste features. Let's start by highlighting ways to quickly select text within the terminal window. To select text in just about any application, including SecureCRT, you would normally press the left mouse button, drag the mouse to the desired stopping point, and release the mouse button. Performing a double-click action will select the entire word under the mouse pointer. If you keep holding the mouse button down after double-clicking, additional words are added to the selection as you move the mouse pointer over another word. By default, SecureCRT considers words to be made up of any combination of letters, numbers, or the underscore character. All other characters are treated as word separators or word delimiters. You can modify word delimiter characters in the terminal category of SecureCRT's session options to allow for automatic double-click selection of IP addresses, email addresses, or blocks of characters you would prefer to treat as words. You could use the space character as the only delimiter and anything bounded by spaces would be considered a word. You might need more sophisticated word selection behavior, so consider using this set of characters as your word delimiter character set if SecureCRT's default set does not meet your needs. Triple click selects the entire line under the mouse pointer. If you keep the mouse button down after triple clicking, additional lines can be added to the selection by moving the mouse cursor up or down before releasing the button. A rectangular column of characters can be selected independently by pressing the ALT key while selecting text. Once column selection mode is activated, you can release the ALT key and column selection mode will remain active until the mouse button is released. A selected area of text can be adjusted with a shift click. The original selection mode is maintained, so shift click will continue word selection mode adjusting the selection and word block increments. As another example, if column select mode was used to make an initial selection, shift click will adjust the selection by columns. All the text, both on the screen and in the scrollback buffer, can be selected by choosing Edit, Select All, or using the Control Shift A keyboard shortcut. As of SecureCRT version 6.0, when you select text in the terminal screen, it is automatically copied to the clipboard. If you would rather copy selected text to the clipboard as a separate action, you can change the behavior. Open Global Options, browse to the Terminal category, and disable the Copy on Select option. If you have disabled the Copy on Select option, you can manually copy text to the clipboard in a variety of ways. The following keyboard shortcuts work with SecureCRT out of the box for copying selected text into the clipboard. If you like the standard Ctrl-C shortcut for copying text, you can open Session Options, browse to the Terminal Emulation Mapped Keys category, and enable the Use Windows Copy and Paste Hotkeys option found in the CUA settings. If you enable this option, interaction with a remote shell will be impacted. You won't be able to send Ctrl-C, Ctrl-V, Ctrl-A, or Ctrl-F characters using the corresponding built-in keyboard shortcuts. Most individuals who interact with remote Unix systems should not enable this option. If you wish to make this change to more than one session at a time, watch our Sessions video series. Using your mouse, you can open the main Edit pull-down menu and choose Copy. SecureCRT also provides a right-click context menu for choosing from a list of actions, such as copy. Individuals switching to SecureCRT from other products might have grown accustomed to a different right-click behavior, so a configuration prompt appears the first time you right-click in the terminal window, allowing you to specify your preferred behavior. If you choose Paste Clipboard Contents, SecureCRT will always paste immediately whenever you right-click within the terminal window. A context menu won't be displayed if you make this choice. If you choose Display the Context menu, you'll be shown a menu with a number of available actions whenever you right-click within the terminal window. To switch between supported right-click behaviors, open Global Options, select the Terminal category, and modify the Paste on Middle or Right button setting to match your preference. If the option is set to Paste on Middle button or disabled altogether, the Context menu will appear whenever you right-click in the terminal window. Control shift v and shift insert are keyboard shortcuts for pasting that will work within SecureCRT out of the box. The Control v keyboard shortcut will paste if you've enabled the CUA option described earlier. 
With the mouse, pasting text is as easy as right-clicking or middle-clicking if you've configured SecureCRT with this behavior. The combination of the two options, Copy on Select and Paste on Middle Mouse Button, can provide valuable time savings without eliminating the right-click context menu. Pressing both the left and right mouse buttons together at the same time will act as a middle mouse button click in SecureCRT. If you're OK with repetitive long-distance mouse travel, the Edit menu is available for choosing Paste. That's all for this video. The upcoming video, Advanced Copy and Paste Tips, will reveal even more time savings related to copy and paste functionality available in SecureCRT.